Hello Lillas, welcome back to my channel guys. If you're new to this channel, then guess what? Go ahead and hit that subscribe button, click the bell to be a part of the notification squad. And don't forget to give this video a thumbs up, like, comment, share. And if you're not a part of the chatterbox, the chatter, <laughs> the chatterbox, um, you can join uh, for as low as $1.99, which uh, gives exclusive video content and then an update. And the next tier is $4.99 for live streams and also video content, um, et cetera, et cetera, everything in that, uh, that level. Um, if you're on a, if you're using any type of Apple product, you might have to go to my homepage and go from there. If you're looking to upgrade your membership and you're using uh, Apple product, you also have to go to the homepage and look for the three little dots and click upgrade, da, 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 da. They basically credit you based off of how much you've used in that month something I don't I don't want to get into all that but anyway nevertheless as you can see this is my cuddle um she is the oh my gosh I can never say it's a Roson a Rosen uh by Jamie Lynn Powers she is uh on a small newborn body so she actually um Fitz newborn she's painted to be a very very fresh newborn um, if you look at the scope it has very puffy eyes um, under the eyes and stuff you could tell that it's a fresh baby um, still focusing learning to focus their little eyes etc etc um, this baby is available as a ball baby and the reason why I am not taking the time to root this baby or offer rooting for this baby is because, as you guys know, I have about eight other babies lined up for rooting and I just can't root them all. So I wanted to offer out some ball babies here and there in between. Uh, and also, sometimes I have collectors that root but don't paint or artists that can root and paint and they sometimes or sometimes people know people that are root for them etc and some people don't mind having a ball baby so that's why i i just offer them some time and it, it usually pans out eventually i know a lot of people like here uh, but i just i just cannot root them all i don't have the time my wrist needs a break <laughs> Um, so there's that. But anyway, she is just wearing hand mitts and she's on a Reggie Ann's body and she does have powder wafer scents in her. So she does smell very baby. Um, she takes a pacifier as you can see. And of course you could always change this baby to a boy if you like. This one will be going home as a girl just simply because that's what I have here for her and so this is her without I think her lip color came out really really nice I don't think that the camera does her justice um, I was really happy with the uh, coloring she just very very newborn in color I'm actually going to repeat it on one of my personal babies not exactly I can never duplicate the same but I know a lot of people usually cannot visualize a baby looking cute with uh, without having on all the frills and clothes and all that and stuff and I like to, to see the babies without everything that's just me I fall for a sculpt when it's blank before I fall for it when it's painted. There are some time I fall for them when they're painted afterwards. And, um, but usually I could usually look at a sculpt and say, oh, I'm gonna love that one. Now I could put her on a hat, but what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put her on a little outfit 
that had that's not gonna cover up her cloth and I'm gonna just go from there and see what she looks like in this purple I just think that it, uh, she has rooted eyebrows and eyelashes so sometimes they get a little bushy I just think when I'm in my own personal space and they're not like taking pictures, et cetera, et cetera, sometimes I just like, oh, I could put them on <laughs> regular clothes. Sometimes, believe it or not, like the depending on like how you have them posed, the cloth isn't that distracting as you would think. I don't know if other cuddle baby moms have done it before and you know like had them like their cloth out but it it's funny because it, it just I guess maybe because in my head I already know she's a cloth baby it doesn't take away oh my hands are so ashy and horrible I got a lot to do today I don't have a lot of time so I make this quick I think she's gonna look good in purple I'm gonna switch her socks out. I found on the Cuddle Babies too that using booties or stuff like this with the distraction like this, it gives them a more shaped foot than just a regular sock. So if you have cuddles, booties, shoes, stuff like that actually works really well. Um, I suggest those over socks if you're gonna like buy a lot of Instead of buying a lot of socks, try to buy, I'm um, probably fix her eyebrow a little bit more. Um, try to find more booties. I'm actually going to do a cuddle for myself with, without the, um, hands and feet. And that's what I'm going to be, um, going for the... I'm trying to think. Hold on one second. Mm. Yep. So there you go. Oh, your little hat's getting kind of one of your yarns. Everybody wear this hat. Poor rat. The hat been wore out. And there you have it. So I. I think she still looks cute. There we go. I'm gonna pull this up a little bit. She's a cute vein right there. <laughs> so yeah, um, a lot of stuff don't show up on camera but yeah she's see i'm a cutie let's see now you can't even see her eyes are hazel by the way and they're really pretty a, a light like a light brown there we go but I know that you can't really see that here, even, I don't care how much light I put in there. Maybe you can see just a little bit, but it kind of washes her out a little bit, but yeah. So anyway, that is it. I just wanted to share her. If you are interested in having your first little cuddle or an, another cuddle, 
to your collection and you want to bring this one home contact me um she is going to be on sale for a few days oh i like i like this one i want to take a picture of her like this um yeah she'll be on sale i'm gonna make the announcement in the chatterbox first and offer it to them first at her uh, sale price and then I will post it publicly on Facebook and Instagram and then that will be it and I'm probably gonna run this sale for just about three or four days so all right see you guys later bye bye